uh, this is a uh, capital O and uh, it wants a return statement okay so return true okay okay so I'm not sure what that does but we're gonna have to create a switch statement in the on area touched to handle what happened so you type this switch and you're gonna it, it's gonna be the p this variable this is a we're gonna use and you're gonna type in get dot get action okay and inside the switch statement we're gonna have uh, the following uh, cases so many case touch event dot action down colon and I'm gonna fill in break right now just not to forget it and uh you can add other touch event uh later touch i mean uh other touch event dot uh action move i mean i won't i won't do nothing with the move but this is how you would handle it. Dot action up and then break. This is where you put uh, whatever you want to happen there. So what's going to happen here is I'm going to declare a variable that is going to be boolean. It's going to decide which one to show and uh, which image to show the red or the black and this is over here is gonna toggle that and it's gonna set the uh, uh, the the two sprites visible or not visible according to that so I'm gonna declare a uh, variable a boolean type variable And I'm gonna call it my black or red. I'm gonna set it to true right away. Black or red. And this is gonna be the toggle uh, between. So basically, when someone clicks on uh, this, is the black sprite that's gonna show at this point. So when someone clicks on it, what it's going to do first is it's going to say my black or red equals not and then same thing. Uh, I'm going to type it again. Basically it's going to take the opposite. So if it was true then it's gonna make it false. If it was false, it's gonna make it true. The other thing we're gonna have to do is set the my player black animated sprite dot set visible and we're gonna set it to the my 
I'm pretty sure I black or red there you go and it's gonna it's gonna set this so this is gonna toggle first and it's gonna do that now uh, we haven't declared a uh, we haven't created a red sprite but we're gonna so I'm just gonna copy this and I'm just gonna change this to red because that's what it's gonna be called and right now it, it gives me an error message it doesn't know what is that but in a minute we're gonna uh, create that so down here I'm gonna copy paste the exact same thing except it's gonna be over here it's gonna change to red but other than that it's gonna be the exact same thing and it's uh, the only thing difference is the, the red is here and it's gonna take the image uh, from the red texture region and uh, and that's why it was copied in there.